L. F. Wade International Airport IATA, BDA, ICAO, TXKF, formerly named Bermuda International Airport, is the sole airport serving the British Overseas Territory of Bermuda in the North Atlantic Ocean. It is located in the parish of St. George's and is 6 nm 11 km, 6 .9 miles northeast of Bermuda's capital, Hamilton. In 2016, L. F. Wade International Airport handled about 402,925 passengers, up 5.6% from 2006. It has one passenger terminal, one cargo terminal, eight aircraft stands and can support all aircraft sizes up to and including the Airbus A380. Currently, seven airlines operate seasonal or year-round scheduled services to Bermuda Airport from Canada, the United Kingdom, and the United States. Topic history The airfield began life as Kindley Field, a joint U.S. Army Air Forces USAAF, Royal Air Force RAF base, during the Second World War. The RAF forces in Bermuda were withdrawn at the end of the war. The local RAF commander, however, stayed on, on loan to the Bermuda government, and converted the RAF facilities into the Civil Air Terminal, operated by the local government. When the pre-war airport, a flying boat facility on Darrell's Island, closed in 1948, Bermuda's air routes were taken over by land planes operating through the airfield, which by then was operated by the United States Air Force, as Kindley Air Force Base. In 1970, the field was transferred to the United States Navy, which operated it as U.S. Naval Air Station, Bermuda until 1995 when the U.S. Navy terminated its 99-year lease and the field was transferred to the Bermuda government, which now operates the airport as part of the Ministry of Tourism and Transport. The U.S. Navy was not required to meet international civil air standards, despite the operation of civil airlines to the base. The Bermuda government, however, was required to meet these standards very quickly on assuming control, and at some expense. This involved changes to the airfield lighting, erecting new fences, leveling anything over a certain height and within a certain distance of the runway including the former base commander's residence, and the hill it stood on, and other changes. The airport is at the west of St. David's Island, and to the south of Ferry Reach. This places it in the east end of the archipelago, several miles from the current capital, Hamilton. The airfield was built between 1941 and 1943 by leveling Long Bird Island and several smaller islands, and filling in the waterways between them and St. David's Island. This created a landmass contiguous with St. David's, and the airfield is typically described as being in, or on, St. David's. The field originally had three runways, but only the longest is still in use. Airport map January 1963 One of the others, most of which is on a narrow peninsula jutting into Castle Harbor, has been blocked by munitions bunkers that were built at the harbor end. There are further bunkers on the west side of the peninsula, and the U.S. Navy had referred to the area as the Weapons Pier. Airport workers, today, refer to it as the Finger. The other former runway is today a taxiway to connect aprons 1 and 2 to the active runway, and the taxiway which parallels it. This was last used as a runway in 1978. It has its own former taxiway paralleling it, which now serves as a dispersal area for visiting aircraft. On 16 April 2007 the airport was renamed L.F. Wade International Airport in honor of L. Frederick Wade, father of L. Frederick Wade Jr. L. Frederick Wade was a leader of the incumbent governing party, the Progressive Labour Party when it was in opposition. The name was criticized by the opposition United Bermuda Party for being politically biased. On the 16th of March 2017, the government of Bermuda signed an agreement with the Canadian Commercial Corporation, granting Skyport a 30-year concession to manage and operate the airport. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Current operations. In 2017, the airport handled almost 500,000 passengers. Airline flight arrivals and departures usually peak June-August summer season. It has received high marks in passenger satisfaction surveys, placing first among North American airports in the under 15 million passengers category in 2003 and fourth worldwide in its size category, according to the Global Airport Monitor report that year. Cited were courtesy of staff, security, and check-in facilities. The former NATO hangar built in the early 1990s is now used for the airport's growing corporate jet traffic. 
Because of Bermuda's considerable distance from the nearest land mass, the airport's use by general aviation aircraft is limited to jets and long-range turboprops. Only jet fuel is available. The airport offers U.S. Customs and Immigration preclearance, which means U.S.-bound passengers clear customs in Bermuda. Flights arriving in the U.S. from Bermuda are thus treated as domestic flights. Air Traffic Control Service is provided by CI2 Aviation under contract to the Department of Airport Operations Dow. The control tower is located on the north side of the airport not to be confused with the old tower located at the terminal building and provides service for most of the day and night. Approach, departure and on-route traffic control in the surrounding oceanic sector is provided by New York Air Route Traffic Control Center ZNY, under an agreement between the U.S. government's Federal Aviation Administration and the United Kingdom. The BDA Tower Controller and ZNY Center Controller are always in close contact. Remote radio transmitters and air traffic radar coverage at the airport also link Bermuda and New York Center. A modern Doppler weather radar with a 150 miles range was built by the Dow in 2005. Navades at the airport, such as the Instrument Landing System (ILS) and VOR (VHF Omnidirectional Range), are owned by the Dow but maintained by Ba Serco. The airport was a United States government NASA Space Shuttle launch abort site. It was only able to be used during low and mid inclination launches. The airport is also active in affairs of the Airports Council International ACI, hosting the industry organization's Legal Affairs Committee annual meeting in 2005. In 2006, ACI selected the airport to host its World Assembly, which was held in Bermuda in November 2010, attended by hundreds of delegates representing airports worldwide. The airport's current general manager is Aaron Adderley. A small portion of the southeast corner of the airport was transformed in the 1990s into Bermuda Motorsports Park. From March 2017, Bermuda Skyport Corporation Limited will manage and operate LF. Wade International. The 30-year airport concession includes construction of a new passenger terminal, to be completed in 2020. Topic airport Agencies Bermuda Skyport Corporation Limited, the Airport Concessions Company. Bermuda Airport Authority Department of Civil Aviation DCA, responsible for aircraft registration, safety regulation, and accident investigation, part of the Ministry of Tourism and Transport. Bermuda Immigration HM Customs U.S. Customs and Border Protection, pre-clears passengers on most flights to USA. Airport Rescue Firefighting ARF, operated by Bermuda Fire Service from 2007 Bermuda Fire Service, East End Station sits astride perimeter, and provides support to ARF. Airport Security Police, enforces airside regulations and security under contract to the Dow. Bermuda Police Service, enforces landside parking and traffic regulations, and holds arrested persons. Bermuda Weather Service, operated by Serco under contract to the Dow. Topic. Airlines and destinations Topic. Passenger Topic. Cargo Topic. Accidents and incidents On 6 December 1952 a Cubana de Aviation DC-4 crashed after taking off from the airport killing 37 passengers out of 41 passengers and crew. On 27 October 1962, a U.S. Air Force Boeing RB-47 Stratajet crashed on takeoff, killing all four crew members on board. See also Royal Air Force, Bermuda, 1939 to 45. Hurricane Fabian. Hurricane Igor. Transport in Bermuda. The Causeway, Bermuda. Hurricane Gonzalo.